Right, welcome to what is probably going to be the shortest one of these I've ever done. Here's the album we're talking about today. Time Odyssey by Vinnie Moore. Um, so, I did a Vinnie Moore one of these earlier. And again, it's just like Tony McElpine, except not, I'm sorry, just not quite as catchy and hooky. The guy can definitely play. It plays really, really well. But the songs didn't really do much for me. They just, I mean, I'm sorry. They were produced really well. Obviously, a lot of time was taken to arrange them and write them. But they just, I went through it and through it. And almost nothing stayed with me. It didn't resonate. Um, the best song on here is As Time Slips By. I'll put a link to that over here. As Time Slips By. Beautiful stuff. Um... And other than that, even though there was a lot of work put into this, I did not walk away remembering any of it. So I'm very, very sorry. So, uh, but if you're into like uh, guitar instrumentals and, and and like really meticulously well played uh, shredding kind of guitar, uh, and there's some really great melodic moments on here, uh, check it out. But the songs kind of left me a little bit. I don't know. I I'm, I don't mean to disrespect because I know that. That worked really hard on this, especially when it's like one guy who does all the writing and the producing and the performing. I know how much heart and soul and time that takes. Uh, just didn't connect with me. Maybe it's because I'm not a guitar player. Might be that. Anyway, um, if you're into that kind of thing, the Tony McAlpine stuff, I would ch I would check it out. But um, other than that, it's probably, it's not for everybody. So there you go. Uh, those are my thoughts on Time Odyssey by Vinnie Moore. That's it. Ooh, I'm going to do this. It's under two minutes. An under two minute review. All right. Subscribe to the channel and I'll leave more that are a little more interesting. Thanks.